Hey everybody, welcome back to Am on Your Hero. So, we're going to work on some abuse techniques that you can use for people that's been abusing you and things like that. So here's some prevention techniques that is going to allow you to walk around, whether your apartment, you know, wood floor, um, in hard shoes, like shoes that are for all terrain. And uh, this is going to allow you to sneak around the house and just be normal without having your abuser pretty much catch you. So, you don't want to sneak on your tiptoes. That's basically the wrong way to do it. I've tried that. It makes noise. So, what you want to do is roll your feet. Check it out. So, these shoes here, as you can see, they're really rough. They're all-terrain shoes, all-terrain snow, gravel. You know, they have very good grip. This here is soft, and it's like slick this here is like rubber it's hard okay this is gives you a really good grip but it's an all-terrain shoe but all-terrain shoe is hard to sneak in because as you roll your shoe down these points kind of make a, a a slight bump noise so but i'll show you even with the all-terrain shoe okay so look at my feet so I'm going to walk normal, and it's going to make some noise. You don't want to do that, okay? And I'm going to try to sneak out. Most of you would probably sneak around the house or try to get around your abuser just to even get some food, like orange, like I used to do. You can still hear that, okay? This is the proper way where you're not going to be making any noise, you're not going to vibrate the floor, it's not going to thud or anything. But in an all-terrain shoe, it'll make a small bump. Small little bump noise. Here's how you do it. So, take a look at my foot, okay? Heel first. Roll your foot onto the ball of your feet. Start with your heel. Roll it onto the balls of your foot. So we're just going to walk normal, but quiet. Okay? This is the speed you will most likely be moving. It's slow. But it's not this slow. Okay? It's not that slow. So I'm going to try normal speed, but walking like that. So I'm going to do a trick. Now, right before my feet hit the ground, I'm picking up a little bit more. This allows me more control as I'm walking. Okay? This is what's going to help you go around the house. Okay? And later on, I'll have to teach you exactly how to open and shut doors quietly, like at night or when you're hungry or you're Whatever abuser is trying to do, not let you have any food and you need to get in the refrigerator, I'm going to show you later on on those things. But for now, just so you can get around without alerting your abuser, whether he's in a room or somewhere or he's upstairs or downstairs and he can hear you walking around, just so you don't learn, just remember, step with the ball, step with your heel first and roll that foot. Keep that ball of your foot up and roll it. So the next one, you're still rolling. See, even the back ones is rolling still. Now, a better example would be with the feet. With your feet, you have padding, okay? Like, check this out. See how that, you can, it's like a squeeze, just kind of squeezes, it's padding. It's very soft. It is not hard. This don't move, y'all. This does not move. See? It just, this is hard. This here has like small padding. So with your actual feet here, all right, it even got wrinkles. It, 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 you, you got way more control. You can feel things. You can move even these parts here. Okay, so that's how you're going to be walking. Okay. Now I'm barely making any noise. All right, so 
that'll be it. So that's how to sneak around the house and um, not to, so that you don't alert your abuser, whoever type of abusers they may be. Molesters, rapists, you know, physical abusers, mental abusers, people who verbally put you down, wherever it is, so that you don't alert them around the house or even if they're below you and they're trying to listen to you or they're trying to listen in, that's one way you can get around the house and try to live a little bit normal life until you get old enough to move out. So that's just one trick of abuse uh, prevention and abuse avoidance. Uh, I want to thank y'all for watching. I'm going to put myself back on now.